everybody for another uh, episode of boss fights. I'm about to go on and uh, fight the boss Gwendolyn. Not exactly a necessary one, and I already know an NPC you know, that is the original bonfire keeper for the area is going to hate my living guts after this and want to try to kill me, which I'm going to have to kill her. But, oh well. Hey, it's Dark Souls. You gotta go and you know, deal uh, with the depressing uh, stuff, otherwise it just drags you down. Alright, hope you guys enjoy. This is gonna be one hell of a really weird cutscene because Gwendolyn is a guy, but he looks like a chick. I mean, even his whole figure looks like it's a girl. Even the name Gwendolyn sounds like a girl. I mean, seriously, does anybody uh, 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 just uh, think, huh, Gwendolyn? That's gotta be a chick. No, come to find out, it's actually a dude. It's like one of those anime uh, freaking uh, traps, like in Naruto. The character Haku. I can guarantee a good portion of people went and thought Haku was a chick, but Haku's a guy. This is basically yeah, the exact example of that. Oh, oops. Wrong thing. There we go. What foolishness. Thou art a disciple of the Dark Sun. Mark the words of mine self, Gwyndolin. I will admit, he does do some trivia. Thou shalt not magic. go unpunished. His spells are OP as heck. Here we go. And with this one, it's actually just kind of simple. All I gotta do is just weave in and out of his attacks. In one of my subscribers' words, Tormented Angel, Gwendolyn's about to get wrecked.
because now he's just on a sliver of health left. And even if my enchant runs out on my weapon, I'm still gonna be able to kill him, so... Spells, they still always zig trip me up. They always do. Uh, well, that was another episode of Dark Souls boss battles. Hope you guys enjoyed. And Joseph, if you're seeing this, yeah, you just saw the easiest way at how to kill Gwendolyn, even in New Game Plus. So, have fun. Hope you guys enjoyed this. See you next time.